Good day, friends. Dr. Bob Hamilton here. And as you know, I am the host of the Hamilton Review, where kids and culture collide. Every kid loves a parade. They're one of my favorite things. And the biggest parade in the world is the Rose Parade. And it was a pleasure to this week to have Mark Steinus, who is the host for KTLA of the Rose Parade. Mark Steinus, thanks for being part of the Hamilton Review. Thank you so much for having me on. I, uh, as you know, I have known you a very long time, um, but I want to talk with you about a couple of things and I hope you're okay with this. Okay. Absolutely. Well, that right back there is the chair I sat in while working 17 years at entertainment tonight. I keep it nearby. It's got my name on it. So nobody else in the family can sit in it, but <laughs> Uh, now everybody wants to know about the best celebrity you talk to or whatever. I'm gonna, we'll chat a little bit about that because I think that's very interesting why people want to know that. But I'm also going to tell you about people that I have met who are, I won't say better than celebrities, but played better roles or actually live better roles than some of the celebrities are portraying uh, on the big screen, some of the, your favorites, um, and why some of them are hard to get to know. And then I, I do want to take a minute, if, and as you said, where, where kids and culture collide, I want to talk about the Rose Parade, if you allow me that opportunity, because sure. I think having the Rose Parade as something on my um, uh, resume is something that I'm so proud of. Yes, it's once a year, but becoming a student of something that is really part of the fabric of America is an ongoing effort. And every year I learn more and more about why this day is so special and what it means to so many people. So friends, you are in for a treat. Uh, so tune in this week to the Hamilton Review. You'll be glad you did. Until next time, take care.